Hi everybody, welcome to Cake Tasta Cakes. It's Jen and I'm gonna show you how to decorate a cake to make it look like marshmallow. This is gonna be really fast and really easy. Uh, you get a white cake like you saw in the intro there, just a white cake, one layer. Make sure it's nice and tall. And then go online and print out the face. That's what I did, I cut it out. I'm taking some black gum paste, rolling it out as you can see, nice and thin. I'm taking my cut out of my eyes and I'm just tracing them out on the same thickness that they're all gonna be on. I kept them in order because the shape of the eyes is a little different from the left and the right. So keep them, like I said, keep them in order when you cut them out. Uh, when you cut them out, you might have a couple little rough edges. Just, you know, pick them up, smooth them off, put them to the side. Don't try to freehand this, all right? Don't try to make a couple of X's or do it on your own. Take the time to find and print out a little template to follow. It's gonna make it look a lot nicer. He's very basic, so the few little details that he does have, you're going to have to be careful of. So there's the one eye, there's the other eye, and I'm going to use the same piece now for the mouth, just like before. Three little pieces, real quick and real easy. And so if you have a kid or anybody who is a fan of his music or plays Fortnite and wanted the marshmallow skin... This is a real easy way to do it. It makes a really good Fortnite cake, actually, to just kind of segue onto that a little bit. It makes a great layer. If you're having a couple of tiers, it's a very simple one that you can put to take up a lot of space. If you don't feel like putting all the detail that otherwise could go into a Fortnite cake layer. So, yeah. Anyway, okay. There's the face. And I'm holding up to the cake. Now, pay attention to this, too, because his face is really large on his head. If you look at the pictures of him, his eyes and his mouth are huge. So that's why my template almost perfectly fits the size of the cake I've got there. It's actually a um, six inch round pan I used, two inches deep, and there's three of them there stacked on top of each other. So I ended up ripping it up a little bit just to make matching up a lot easier. So I held it up, put the pieces in place accordingly, just follow along, just like all those little puzzles we did when we were little tiny kids. Three little pieces, and there you go on your white cake, and you got marshmallow. So how nice and easy is that? I told you it was going to be quick. Hopefully you found this video helpful. Hopefully you'll like and subscribe. Please check out my other videos. And I do have extra links in the description below if you need any tools or supplies. And thank you, as always, guys, for watching Cake Tasta Cakes.